on Ice Hockey UK TV in association with SMP Europe. I'm joined by the GB women's head coach, Mike Clancy. Mike, welcome. I want to start with the camp a few weeks ago, the first one in a long time for GB women. Just how good was it to get everyone back on the ice? It was really, really important after such a long um, layoff from the ice. It was a great opportunity for me to uh, meet the playing group, meet the management team, um, set out some of the expectations and, and really put the girls through the paces, which, which was good to see. And how would they respond to it? Because obviously it's a, it's a new regime now. Your, your first kind of session that was as a head coach in charge of the team. How did you find that and their response to what you were telling them? I, I thought their response was absolutely fantastic. We, we talked a little bit about what we're expecting from a main style this year. So a little bit different to enable us to be a bit more competitive, a little bit more goal hungry, get some of those bits that were missing previously. But great conversations in the team meets, um, great opportunity to see the compete level when you challenge the girls. So no, really, really good and really positive. Your second one is this weekend in Sheffield. What sort of things will you be doing now a few weeks on? Well, I, I suppose it's still the same. For, for us, we, we still haven't selected the team. Um, we, we're less than, what, 12 weeks now before we're away in, in October. Um, time's running away. We've only had one training session so far in our proper preparation for the Olympic qualifiers. So we're, we're still at team selection. So a lot more competes, a lot more station work. Really let me um, get an understanding of where the girls fit in the, the team that we want to put out and we want to play the, the style that we're looking to play. It's, it's all good. Yeah, so basically, there's a lot of places still up for grabs. You, you, you know, people, girls that are attending this camp and the future ones, you've got places up for grabs and competition for places. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I never came into this with a preconceived idea of what the team looked like. I certainly knew what, what style I wanted to play and how I thought I could help the girls develop their game and, and get the successes that we're looking for and hungry for. But yes, um, we, we've not selected the team. We've got a lot of talking to do after this next camp. Um, and hopefully we'll, we'll be in a better place to select the girls that, that will compete for us um, in Korea.